everyone welcome to the channel friends today i will show you how to divide a circle into seven equal parts with the help of a compass or a rounder whatever you call it you need to have a scale a pointed pencil and that's all so let's begin drawing don't forget to keep the point of your pencil sharp so the first step is to draw a circle obviously because we want to divide the circle into seven parts so take draw a circle take appropriate distance between your rounder as big you want your circle to be for example i'm taking a three centimeter distance in in my rounder so and uh first step is to draw a circle so place your point on the paper keep it steady and let's draw circle okay quickly mark the center of the circle as O now draw a vertical diameter through the circle to draw a vertical diameter just place your scale and draw a line that passes through the center of the circle just draw a random line that passes through the center of the circle just keep it light because geometry is uh, light. Geometry is to be drawn with a lighter pencil. But for video purpose, we are just making this dark. But I'll uh, mark the... Okay, I'll just darken the line for your understanding purpose. But we don't generally use darker geometry. So, the next point is... So, uh, do you want me to mark this points A and B for understanding purpose? A, B is the diameter now. Now, with the radius, with the distance of the radius, now B, O, B, O is the radius of the circle, right? So, uh, keep the pointer on B and draw a semicircle. Okay? Draw a semicircle. Now this semicircle intersects our uh, original circle at two points, right? So we'll name this point C and D. And now we will join this line. We will join C D. So we'll just place a scale and we will join C D. So we have joined C D. Now we get this point which is the center of CD which lies on our vertical diameter let's call it M now the next step towards dividing the circle into seven equal parts measure the distance of CM the next step we will do is measure the distance CM CM that's it CM okay. with this distance CM keep the pointer on A and draw a semicircle type. Draw it with V. We need two R. So draw a semicircle from A. Okay. So now we got two more intersection points. Let's name it E and F. E and F are the two intersection points. So now A, E, F are the three points. Now if you measure the distance of A and E, it is the same. Now keep the rounder on E and draw an arc on the circle. Now we are pointing the vertices of the seven parts. We already have now three A, E, F. Now this is the fourth G. Now we will need the fifth. So keep your pointer on G and draw the fifth. Okay, now keep your pointer on the fifth and draw the sixth. Okay, H and I. Similarly, keep. we need one more to divide it into seven parts. So keep the pointer on I, draw the seventh and the last one. I and J. Correct? So now we have in total seven points. A, E, G, H, I, J and F. So, to divide the circle into seven parts, we have to join each of these points with the center O. So, 
so I will just take a scale and we'll first join OA then we'll join OE then we'll join OG then we'll join OH then we'll join OI then we'll join OJ and at last we will join OF so oh wow we get seven parts of the circle we'll just name it one two three four five six and seven there it is there we get seven parts to our circle if you if you draw it lighter for video purpose I've drawn so much of dark geometry but you need to draw it with a lighter pencil without applying much force so that you can see the seven parts clearly okay this semicircle and this semicircle I've uh, drawn very dark but you need to draw it lighter okay so that's it. How did you like the video? Just hit the subscribe button please so I get motivated and I keep creating new videos for you guys. And you can hit the like button then I'll take your leave then for today. I'll see you next with the later with the next video. See ya. Bye bye.